Thank you for joining me for today's video. Today we're going to transform a popsicle into a ladybug popsicle. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you can be the first to draw with me. We're going to start drawing our popsicle at the top of the popsicle. We're going to draw a curved line down, kind of like half of a rainbow, but it's a lot longer and taller, and then we're going to draw the other half. Close it up on the bottom with a straight line. And for the popsicle stick, it's the same shape, only smaller and upside down. We're going to draw two eyes for our popsicle in the middle. The eyes are circles. And they're about in the middle of the popsicle. And then we're going to draw two half circles on each eye. The top one's a little bit bigger and the bottom one's a little bit smaller. This is going to be the reflections for our eyes, where the light would reflect. For the mouth, we're going to draw a straight line across and a V shape on the bottom. And then that straight line, we're going to extend a little bit so it looks like our popsicle is smiling or sticking out his tongue. Now to turn it into a ladybug, we need spots. And we're going to draw circles for those. They're about the same size as the eyes, maybe a little bigger. Maybe you could do them a little bit smaller. Just space them out where you think they look good. Some can be half circles, some can be a full circle. I try to keep them all about the same size as each other though. So for this one I fit on five. You can put more, you can put less, depends on how big your popsicle is. And now we're going to outline everything with black permanent marker. This is going to make your drawing stand out, it's going to pop off the page. It also helps for when you're coloring to, so that it doesn't smear to use a permanent marker. Use a regular marker and then color your ladybug red with a regular marker that's likely that they'll smear together. So a permanent marker is a good choice. Outline your spots, fill them in. For the eyes, we're going to outline the eye, outline the lines we drew for the reflections, but we're only going to color in the center part. That way the reflections stay white. And then our ladybug needs antenna. So we're going to draw two antenna on top, a curved line with a little circle on the end, and another curved line with a little circle on the end. And if it goes through or touches one of your spots on your ladybug, that's okay. I'm just going to take an eraser, erase a few spots that I missed with the permanent marker, and then you can start coloring. And I'll speed this part up so that you don't have to watch me color all the time. But the only color that we need for our ladybug is red. We'll need a different color for the stick, but just for the ladybug part, all we need is a red marker. If you go on top of the spots a little bit, it's okay. It's not going to show. And your ladybug popsicle is done. And I see that I forgot to color the stick. So let's go back and do that. So like I said before, a brown marker for the stick. And now your ladybug popsicle is done. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I have a lot more drawings coming. We're going to transform a lot more popsicles and a bunch of other things. When you subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you can be the first to draw with me.